Hi and welcome to Sounds Heavenly. My name's Steve and I make the cables that connect Bang & Olufsen. However, today's video has nothing to do with cables, it's about movies. So if you've always wanted a high quality movie system at home, but not really known where to start, this is the video for you. I'm really quite excited about where we are now. I believe, in my slightly biased opinion, that we are in one of the best professional movie cinemas in the UK. I say biased because about five years ago I had the privilege of being able to set up the surround sound system here. This is the Regal Cinema in Melton Mowbray in Leicestershire, which is my local cinema and this is where I get most of my movie viewing enjoyment. So I want to talk you through a little bit about what makes this so special and why this should be a starting point when you're considering a movie system for your home. And I actually suggest that you consider setting aside some of your cinema budget to spend travelling to come out to hear some and see some of your favourite movies in an environment like this to get the best from them and to, to really fully appreciate what's possible. So, very quickly, what makes this cinema so special? The, the sound here is superb. So, on each of the side walls are two JBL surround speakers those are also matched by two more speakers on each side of the rear wall. So you've got four speakers across the back, two on each side. That lets you switch between 5.1 channel surround and 7.1 channels, depending on the movie. The screen is acoustically transparent. So basically the speakers, the main center, left and right channel speakers actually sit behind the middle of the screen about halfway up. The centre one right literally in the centre of the screen, left and right to the outer edges. And that means that when an actor comes on screen and speaks, you actually physically hear them from the screen. So instead of what you might have with a TV soundbar at home where the sound comes from the bottom of the picture, now the sound comes from exactly the point where people are speaking from. And the same as they move across the screen, the sound will track and match exactly where they are in the, the image. That is key to getting the right experience. That centre channel gives you around about 40% of your overall sound for the movie, another 20% or so for the left and right speakers behind the screen as well, so you've got almost two thirds of your sound in those three speakers. Here we also have a professional JBL subwoofer, around about 600 watts capability, an 18 inch drive unit, massive, massive, powerful speaker, which again is behind that acoustically transparent screen. So you get bass that goes right down to the depths of human hearing, and it's at proper THX reference level. So basically, when you play a film at, the, at its maximum level, for the recommended for the movie. You can get bass going down below 20 hertz. If you've got a helicopter exploding, a spaceship crashing, you feel that as well as hearing it. So that's one of the reasons that if you like movies, you need to be experiencing some of your favorite movies in a cinema like this. I would suggest that part of the reason you could come to a cinema like this to evaluate what you, what you need from a movie system is that you should first look at where you naturally want to sit. Now I've chosen one of the luxury sofas here, which is my personal favourite. They're towards the rear of the, the hall, but that means I see the screen just a little bit smaller. But for me, that's not a problem. The trade-off is that I get the comfortable seating and 
I get the feeling that everything is within my um, view without having to turn my head to see the edges of the screen. So if you're, if you're like me and you prefer to have that extra distance from the screen, then you don't need to be spending the extra money on 4K or 8K displays. I'll explain why. It's not the size of the screen that decides the resolution you need, it's the ratio of that screen size measured diagonally against your distance from the screen. If you like to be up close to the screen to the point where you're closer to the screen than that diagonal screen size, then yeah, you definitely should be looking at 4K or above. Because at that closeness compared to the screen size, you will see the definition of the pixels on screen and you need the extra resolution to ensure you see a smooth picture. However, here I'm probably about one and a half times the screen size away from the screen. For me that's comfortable and at this step, distance, 1080p standard full HD is more than enough. This has the advantage putting you right in the middle of the sound sphere. So now we've got rear surrounds behind us, side surrounds directly um, at the sides, and we're about the same distance from the front channels as we are from the rear. So you have eight of the smaller speakers to give you the, the side and rear surrounds and they match perfectly the tone characteristics of the larger front and centre speaker channels, which are also JBL Pro Cinema speakers. Now that is critical. It's not as, as such the choice of speakers, but it's the matching of them. For example, if a plane flies overhead in your movie, or if a couple walk past the camera chatting as they go, you don't want the sound of that, that movement to change in tone as it passes through the surround channels. So whilst you can have smaller speakers for the side and rear, they should be very closely matched to the tone of the main channels. It's something that surprisingly is often missed in commercial cinema, but here we have matched the sides and the rears to the front and centre channels. So you get the proper experience and the levels are properly matched which again is something that is essential to consider at home so that wherever you sit here out of a choice of over a hundred seats you should still get the same experience an actor on the left side of the screen should appear to be speaking from the left side of the screen regardless of where you're sat in the room 40 percent typically of the sound you hear in a movie comes from the centre channel speaker. So get that one right. In particular, if you like period dramas, conversational movies, documentaries, you need that centre speaker to be the best it can possibly be because that's where you will hear all the voices. Again, if you like period dramas, you won't have too many explosions or things like that to worry about, so a subwoofer probably isn't necessary. For a commercial system like this, we need to cover everything. So yeah, the subwoofer is absolutely first rate, goes right down to the depths of the lowest frequencies human hearing can reproduce. There's a rack of amplifiers, all again, all matched, that cover that and make sure we've got the power that's needed. And the subwoofer in this setup also re reduces the strain on the main speaker channels. Any sound below 120 hertz, so about the pitch of my voice, is taken away from the main speakers, routed to that subwoofer instead, which is designed to cope with deep pitches. And the other speakers can then play louder and clearer without having to worry about the deep bass. Now, if you're into action movies, this is where a full 5.1 or 7.1 channel surround system really comes into its own. You need to feel the helicopters flying overhead, you need the explosions behind you, you need the atmospheric effects that pass all round. This is where it's worth really considering the layout of the room, getting those extra channels in place. In the same way as two thirds of the sound comes from the three speakers at the screen, 
as you add more speakers, you get diminishing returns. So get the main part of it right. Let's head back to the workshop. Welcome back to the workshop. I hope that's been helpful to give you some ideas of what goes into a really well thought out and specified movie system. Now, obviously, we specialise in cables for Bang & Olufsen. So if you're particularly thinking of a Bang & Olufsen based home hi-fi system and you're wondering how to connect it and set it up for best results, please get in touch. Our website will appear magically on screen about now. And you can find it at soundsheavenly.com. It contains all the cables and connectors you need to get your music or movie system set up and working. And on the contact page of the website, you'll get access directly to me and my colleagues so that we can help you with any questions that you've got so that you can get the best from your music and movies at home. Please give some love to the Regal Cinema in Melton Mowbray. If you're within travelling distance, I'll put a link to their website in the description of the video. I would love it, and I'm sure they would love it, if you could visit, watch a movie with them, let them know that you saw them via the Sounds Heavenly YouTube video, and that would be great. Thank you very much for joining me. There will be more information to follow with a bit more in-depth detail about setting up your own system at home for high quality surround sound. So please like and subscribe. You'll be the first one to know when the next video comes out. Thanks for joining me.